I'm already tired of the Q4 2025 RAM shortage and you probably are too, so let's run down this week's updates as quickly as we can. Many consumer DDR4 and DDR5 kits have now tripled in price since the beginning of October, with the 64 gigabyte configuration now going for more than a PlayStation 5. So you win this round, console fans. And somehow this new DDR5 speed record at 13,530 mega transfers per second has done nothing to lower street prices. Products that use RAM are now being affected as well though, with system integrators like CyberPower PC and Main Gear publicly stating that they will have no choice but to raise prices soon due to an up to 500% memory surge. They likely have RAM reserves from before the hikes, but those won't last forever. On the bright side though, I say sarcastically, memory manufacturers are profiting already, with revenue up more than 30% in Q3 per trend force. But if you want an unsarcastic bright side, we're at least starting to hear of efforts to boost production to meet demand. With SK Hynix's fab build out budget jumping from $85 billion to $410 billion per reports late last week, and more competitors joining the fray, like China's CXMT, who introduced DDR5 and LPDDR5X products this week too.